haters for back. <laughs> we did a video on this a couple weeks ago. I could only get, I think, two, and Jim was helping me. We're gonna do the 100 pound dumbbell pullovers again, because I've been working at them. Let's see how many I can get. Yeah, last time, for three. one of the little busters commented that it was ego lifting. Ego lifting. But the reason that you lift the hundreds when you're competing with the big boys and considering the pros is so you can go from doing, how many did you do before? What were you doing back then? Oh, uh, like two or three with your help. Two or three with the hundred. I don't think so. I think he did more. Please focus. We'll see what he can do now. It's only been several weeks. That's good too, good stretch all the way down. Hell yeah, look at that stretch. Yeah. Awesome stretch. Awesome, here we go. Stay tight. Oh. You need a little help? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Come on. Come on. A little help is a little this help. Is it. <laughs> I, trust me, <laughs> he almost cracked himself in the nose the last <laughs> Watch your feet, Jim. All right. You know we got to get that video, whatever it takes. Squeeze the chest, there. Yeah. There we go. Now we're breaking four. Now we're getting there. Now we're getting there. Getting there. That's pretty good. So what did you do before all this? You did chest today, right? We did chest today, so uh, we did some dumbbell presses, incline, and then we did uh, some pec deck, some incline hammer strength, uh, some flies, and now the knees are finishing off these with uh, yeah, the chest. So we're trying to put the elbows together a little bit on the way up, squeeze that chest, just to give it a nice finish. Um, you know, pull the waist in, we're getting ready to get skinny now. So for all these, those that said I was too fat in the off season, you're gonna see real quick what it looks like to go from too fat to have that 29 inch waist with them 29 inch quads. I'll see you in 18 weeks.